What is a decision in principle and do you need one? Well, normally when you're looking for a property, estate agents tend to say, have you got a DIP? Have you got an AIP, an agreement in principle? What they want to know is that you're good for the money and that you're good to proceed as far as a bank is concerned so they can inform their vendor, the person they're representing, that you're a safe or a good buyer. To you, what does it mean? Well, it means that you're effectively good for the money because you've been rubber stamped by the bank. Your credit score is okay. You're pretty clear on what you can potentially borrow based on a scenario that we're presenting to a specific bank. Generally, people ask, how long does the agreement in principle last? Well, traditionally, it's three months. But actually, all we're doing is confirming you have a way forward. We're not committing you to a rate or a bank or any such situation. We're just providing confirmation to you and to us that it works. You will know how much you can borrow, what it's going to cost, and that you can proceed. So basically, an agreement in principle is just a way forward. When it comes to you having an offer accept accepted, we will re-look at the marketplace and find you the best rate and deal because it may well have changed. Markets change. So we'll, we need certain documentation to proceed. Give us a call or discuss it with us and we'll get it sorted very, very quickly. It's pretty easy to do.